wonderful people, viewers and subscribers. Um, there is a video that is circulating on the social media platform coming from Instablog about a pastor who, without the consent of his fiance, tried to terminate her pregnancy and it resulted to her death just because he wants to protect his reputation as a pastor. That around nonsense. Oh, yeah, we could watch. If I talk now, you will say I depart five pastors. This one follow for pastor. Now, this is as a result of people trying to play holy in the faces of human while they are evil. Why try to abort a baby? Why try to terminate the life of a baby through abortion? And in the process, kill an innocent woman. Because you never seek her consent before probably giving her drugs to force the child out and the rest of them and some complication resulted to the death of the young woman. Today, he is now being paraded. That reputation you want to, want to protect. Look at it. now. And they want him to umuani especially. Akura na pudo 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 pum. Paube pastor say pastor say pastor say prophet say crap. You know, being too religious without any atom of Christianity in them. In a couple of them one you are busy ta 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 this girl without thinking about your reputation as a pastor. Now you impregnate her. Somebody you say you want to marry. Your own blood, you want to flush it out without her consent. Now look at where it has resulted you to. Sin is a reproach. And it has brought you to that point. And it's a lesson for every one of you. You know, wherever you see a signboard, say, don't say the Lord. You think God is there. And God, through his holy book, said, by their fruit, you shall know them. Not by their prophecy, not by the signs and wonders, but by their fruit. If I talk now, you will say, I defy pastors. I defy um, church. You see him? You see him? Now, I'm no longer talking about the pastors or the church leaders. and the, I'm talking to the people themselves. You need to. You need to go beyond religion and start practicing faith and spirituality. Start having a relationship with your God. Stop being carried away by the so-called men of God who call themselves. I think that is enough. Share this video. Tell your people, especially these young girls who are desperate to enter a man's life. Do not allow any man to terminate your life in the name of religious practice, in the name of you know, if and that is the reason why many young girls because they, they are looking at the societal reputation the family they come from so I had a personal experience and I perhaps these my friends will be watching because the parents, because of their position in the church, want to, want to, eh? if, if I can even the daughter, the daughter was jittering. My friend ran to me. I want to marry this girl. But the parents are saying that he has pregnanted her. Why would she be pregnant before? I'm going to open night in a church. And this is what is driving so many young girls to go and abort babies. And many of them lost their lives in the process. Because of your society game. You know, we are here delivering our people from different bondage, societal bondage. That is what we call social freedom. We are talking about political freedom, economic freedom, spiritual freedom, and social freedom. These are part of it. 
free yourself from societal if a society geku if a name mad geku whether you do good or bad people will still talk so do the right thing do what is right before god and damn whatever anyone will say so my people share this video drop your comment let us help this pastor so called to protect his reputation share this video let others see and learn from this i'm signing out i'm also to peters the voice of the people the voice of god and the voice of our ancestors i have spoken share it drop your comment let me have your opinion bye bye